And let's take a live look outside right now. Sunshine, blue skies. Let's get to meteorologist Cedric Haynes here in the studio with a check on our nice Tuesday afternoon forecast. Cedric. That's right, Latrice. Good afternoon and welcome to the first day of March, which is, of course, also known as meteorological spring. That's right. We're trying to turn the page here, at least when it comes to the season change of weather. Of course, meteorological spring basically starts today, March the 1st, and goes through April and May. Now, the difference between regular spring and meteorological spring is that we start things when we kind of keep records in the weather center. Uh, at the beginning of each month. So the basically the month of March here on the first is when we start off spring. And of course, this is the time frame in March, April and May where we have those crazy weather transitions. So we can get pretty much any type of weather over the next month or two across the region. That means we can get cold shots. We can still get some hot temperatures starting to build into the area. We get rain and storms, of course, and also, yeah, it's not impossible to get snow. You remember back in 93 happened once or twice. Hey, and also note that we, of course, get into the peak season for severe weather. This is our, our main time frame where we see more widespread severe weather events as the pattern changes from winter to spring. We start to see those clashes in the air mass. Now, of course, the official spring equinox occurs on Sunday, March the 20th at 1133 AM. So set your clocks. That's the official arrival of spring there for us. Now for March, it's an interesting month because again, we go from the cooler weather where our average high is 59 average low is 39 to an average high of near 70 by the end of the month and average lows into the mid 40s. It's also one of our wettest months where we average about over five inches of rainfall. Of course, with that being said, we saw almost six inches or almost nine inches of rainfall last month. So that's interesting. And of course, we gained 66 minutes of daylight. Outside blue skies across the area, 58 degrees with all that sunshine and daylight and the warmer temperatures, they're trying to stream in. Mid to upper 50s area wide across the area with that south southeasterly wind. The rest of this afternoon, I think we top out into the mid 60s as we go through about 3, 4, 5 o'clock in the afternoon with plenty of sunshine on this uh, day. So looking pretty good out there. Above average temperatures will be the trend in the next couple of days. The below average temperatures will stay off towards the west. So for us, we're looking at highs in the 70s, near 80 degrees by the time we get towards Sunday, but there's a front next week that will start to change the weather pattern. And as it stalls over the area, we could see wave after wave of heavy rainfall. Remember last week? Yeah, that could continue heading into next week. So that's something we'll be watching for you closely. Let me show you the storm alert seven day forecast mid 70s for the end of the week. That's nice. That's spring light. That's downright pleasant. Latrice.